Hi guys and welcome back. In this video I will add some things and change some things, okay? So here I have uh, the first thing I will change here is the images. This image, it is not res responsive when I make it like this. What is the easiest way to make it great and responsive? I will tell you the best way. Here in the code, I will search for the image. Here I have a cloud and sky. This image here. The simplest way to do it is to give here. I will just delete this class. Okay. Here I will give it a class of image thumb nail. This image now is uh, automa automatically responsive when I make it like this or like this. It is responsive by the bootstrap. And we will do the same for these images. Okay. So here, the spicehead. Then here I have uh, the class of image thumbnail and style. Uh, sorry, not this. I will cut this and paste it here. The style of bedding of zero because you know the thumbnail has a bedding. So I don't need the bedding here. The next one here, I will I will delete this class. And for the fourth one, uh, sorry, the third one. And finally for the last one. Okay. Let's see what we have here when I reload the page. Now this automatically responsive. I just need to edit this to delete the margin of left of 5. Okay, the ML5, I, I will delete this from here. Here. And here. Okay, this one. This. Uh, we just need to be, to put this this uh, double quotation. Okay, now we are done with two of them or three. This one, the olives. This olive. I think we were we were having here the same class, but I deleted this. If you have it, you can delete it. And now the margin left of five, I will delete it. Okay, when I reload, here I got this. This is much great. We just got we got this here. I will delete the margin left for this button. Now this is much great and easier. Okay, the next thing I have here, I want to add a text here. But first, I need to add something different. Here I can give it a class of carousel fade, and then I have. A Fading. Great. I he here I delete the content so I can add a new one. Here I can make a dev with a style a font size of uh, I think uh, one two one two zero pixels will be okay. And here I can make a grilled meat. And here I can make text transform into uppercase. I can break the line here. Break the line. Okay, what now? I will refresh. Here I got this. I can add here a class. Sorry, we got a problem. Okay, I will delete this part here. Here I will give it a class of... Uh, Margin bottom of 5 and bedding bottom of 5. This is much great. I will copy this and paste it for the rest of the items. Here to be chicken. And the last one to be meat. Uh, sorry, to be fish. This one is okay. This is okay. And finally this is okay. I have just changed something here. This uh, the height to be one four zero and the width to be one one zero. It is okay. So now we are done with all of that. This is great. This is great. This is great. 
Okay. Now I can tell you we can add here an another image. Okay. If we take a, a very long time, I will uh, make this in the next video. Okay. So here, I can make a new dev with a class of container. After the last section here, section with a class of gallery. In here, margin top or bedding top, it is okay because I will make it uh, background color of white. So margin top of five. And here, dev with a class of container, and dev with a class of row. And here I can make dev with a class of column, and here text center. Okay, what now? I can add image, the source. Let's get an image from here. Okay, the restaurant. Okay, I will get an image from here. I need. Okay, let's get an image. I think this one is okay. Best Italian restaurant in Cairo. Cairo. I will copy this. I think it is okay. And here, I will give it the source and the class of image. Flight. Let's see what we have here when I reload the page. Not here. Here. So here I got this. This is much great. Okay, okay, okay. I can add padding right of 5 and padding left of 5. Now, everything's done great, I think. I can make the width here to be 100 pixels. Okay, what about uh, like this, uh, 1000. Much better and better, but I do not think so. I think we will delete this one. Let's try here thumbnail. If it is better, I will leave it like this. No, thumbnail is not very good. I will make it flight. Flight is great. Okay. Uh, okay, what now? Here I can add a header here. So here I have... Uh, H1 with a, or I can make it, okay, H1 with a class of text, center, and here I can make it gallery, okay, here I have the gallery, and margin, bottom of 5, great, and I can make here, style of text, transform into uppercase, uppercase, Okay, so now I got this. Great, we have two minutes left. And here I can make text. Okay. And here I can make space. Letter spacing to be 5 pixels. This is much great. Okay. What I can add here more? I am thinking about it. Here I can add a button. Okay, now I can add a button here. After all of what I did here, I can add A with a class of button and button. Success. Got a problem here? Yes. Button success. In here, rule of button. And href of nothing. Of nothing. Okay. Here I can make. Uh, okay. I can make here. Uh, I don't know. I think I can add here. Reservation. Okay. So here I got this. I just need to make there. Text center. We got the same problem here. Okay. Here I can make h1. And close it here. I will cut I will cut this part here and paste it here and here to be text center class of text center great 
and here to be button large okay 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 now everything's done great here I can make a margin job of five much better okay now everything is done great now we are done with adding the gallery page in the next video we will keep going and add more good luck and have fun